So in this video, I want to talk about the chances of a season two for the series known as Farming Life in Another World. And I just actually had finished watching it. I wanted to look into the chances because myself as well as a fan of these different series, I'm always curious about the chances of another season. So this is why I do these kind of things, not just for you, but also for myself as well. Now, this did come out January the 6th of 2023. I don't know why I, was, I keep thinking in my head 2013, but 2023 is when it came out. It is based on a light novel with 12 episodes, and currently, as of right now, it is on high dive, sub, and dubbed. But here's the thing. When I tried to look into the basic question that everyone always has is where to start from the sort of the light, uh, from the light novel, the manga, it is kind of hard. I, I get a lot of sketchy answers of like, oh, well, this is what happened and that's what happened. There does seem to be some stuff that's kind of skipped over in the anime a little bit, which I'm actually going to go over in my review on the other channel as well. But there is some stuff that seems to be kind of skimmed over. Mostly what I could find is that if you want to read the source material, which they some websites refer to the web novel, it basically says if you finish the anime and wish to start the web novel, you can do so technically chapter 85. That is where the events of the anime stop, but the timeline is skewed. For example, by the time the main protagonist already has multiple children running around. So this seems to be a, bit, a little bit of hopping around. And apparently there are 700 plus chapters of the web novel, which seems rather insane when you ask me, but then apparently it covered 85 in the anime. Now, as far as the light novels go, there are seven vo uh, 17 volumes, sorry, that are out. First volume came out in 2017, latest volume came out June of this year, 2024. There are mangas as well, and the mangas do have an English release with 12 uh, volumes as well. Latest one came out February of this year for the Japanese, for the English, July the 16th of 2024 is when Volume 10 will be coming out for the English. So the thing to note here is that there is enough source material for a second season, but the more I look at the information presented, it really does feel like a heavy source material seller. And a lot of that just comes down to how the anime has been presented, the amount of marketing that went into it, and just the general sort of way they've gone about everything. I'm a little bit sad that there isn't like an English release of the light novels. So for light novel readers in the West, we would have to go to the web novel or hope that there is a fan translation. Little bit annoying on that part, but I'm not particularly surprised. This does happen quite a lot. And it's been just over a year now since the anime aired. So looking at the information, I feel like the chances of a second season being announced I think are probably around between 5 to 10%. I don't think it's completely out of the question, but I do think it is a much more lower end. It's not like really low, but I'd say around 10% give or take. That's where my, my gut feels. Mainly because there is a chance that it could get a second season to try and re-promote the source material, especially if more light novel volumes came out. But there is a lot of source material of the web novel as well, so it seems to be that there might be a fair few light novel uh, volumes. That being said, not as much marketing and everything went into it, but that's another thing with High Dive. High Dive has a really bad tendency that they just don't market stuff very well, which also hurts from a Western side of things. I know a lot of people say, hey, but the Japanese is the main consumer now. That used to be the case, but now it's kind of become the Western audience has become a bigger consumer, which we could have a whole debate in a separate video whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, because there's a lot of things to discuss on that end. But I think the chances are quite low. If it does get announced, I'll definitely announce it on the channel. You know me. I keep everyone updated as best as humanly possible for my one mortal body that I have. But I would recommend probably going to the web novel and starting off from chapter 85 if you really wanted to skip through. But honestly, I think there's a fair bit of a difference between the anime and the light novel. And that's something that I'll discuss more in an analysis video because that's more of a review analysis component rather than a speculative chances type thing. So if you can get your hands on the light novel, definitely. The manga is out there so as well. And I've heard the manga does have some really good raunchy stuff in there as well. So again, I think the chances are low, but I don't think they're completely out of the question. But we'll just have to wait and see. I do feel like if Season 2 was to be announced, it would have been announced around now. So I feel like if it doesn't get announced by the end of this year, the chances are even lower again. This window, this like this time period of 
within January of this year to the end of this year is the best window of opportunity where season two could get announced. Anything later than that, I think the chances, again, as I stated, go down. So if anything changes, you know me. If you like this video, hit the like, subscribe, and I'll see you beautiful nerds in the next video.